The Chihuahuan Pacific Train is an important part of the life of some people living, working, or visiting the Sierra Tarahumara. The train travels along the Sierra Madre Occidental in the state of Chihuahua in Mexico. The scenery and vegetation change with the altitude along the ride. The first stop for me is in the town of Krill. Located in the Sierra Tarahumara, Krill is the biggest town in the mountains. Many Tarahumara natives come here for some supplies and to do business with their handcrafts. The Tarahumara culture has been adapting to the civilized way of life. Struggling with the change this implies, from education to income to buy supplies for the different lifestyle, to transportation as most of the shopping has to be done far away from their homes in the mountains. This takes me to the second stop, Las Barrancas del Cobre, or the Copper Canyon in English. Some of the Tarahumaras have dwellings on the mountain rocky walls. The different views up here are magnificent. There is peace. One can feel a very special vibe up here. Let's move on.
Far away from El Divisadero and located at the lower altitude, there is the town of Chinipas. Here I am supposed to find a special reptile. Sobrevivieron a, al impacto del meteorito del Golfo de México en las costas de Yucatán. Lo que representó en aquel entonces la extinción masiva de los dinosaurios. Entonces, pues, es una lástima que hayan sobrevivido a tan grande catástrofe y que ahora no estemos poniendo nada de nuestra parte para seguirlos conservando. Bueno, me dijeron que estaba vivo y lo recogí. Está bajo una piedra. Entonces, lo traje en una jaulita y lo estuve curando, pero era imposible salvarlo. Mire cómo tiene destrozado el... No había cerca eh, poblaciones de humanos que la, que la afectaran en su desarrollo. This mountain reptile is nearly extinct and hard to find alive. In present days, the Chepe train crosses 37 bridges and traverses mountains through 86 tunnels reaching numerous towns in its way. It is a 673 km ride to its last stop on the Pacific coast. It is a real adventure for me.